so um, in this video I would like uh, to share the information that I got about November and let me first start with uh, how special this year is and it's just like so many things uh, just balancing healing and yeah it's the year of 2020 and i was writing about this in uh, the beginning of this year and also i think uh, already in uh, november last year and december that this year is gonna be about uh, duality different extremes facing all of that and everything that it's not healed inside of us and everything that is not in balance inside of us in our life and of course uh, what is also the number zero um, coming back to unity and coming back to ourselves and realizing what we really want in our life what really matters for us what is really important for us and yeah, just uh, really finding the center. Um, for many of you out there also, the, um, your purpose, your mission is becoming clearer. And yeah, it's a, it is a year of truth coming um, out in so many different uh, ways and also um, breaking all different illusions that we have about ourselves, about other people, about life itself and really coming into this uh, moment here and now, letting go all of the stories and everything that is not actually serving us, that it's not actually true. So why I wanted to talk about November uh, is because uh, it is a really special month and I wanted to share all the information that I got um, and yeah, uh, I just wanted to, to also show, you know, that we have this year 2020 and really magical year and with November we have this frequency of 11 and uh, this is the frequency of uh, illumination, so it's going to be uh, a lot of important messages, uh, a lot of important information uh, for us uh, coming uh, through our dreams, through messages, through uh, special events that are going to happen in November and also through numbers in whatever way um, you communicate with yourself with spirit with your guides so be more grounded be more aware and be more aware of all these messages that you are receiving allow yourself to open up and receive this light and of course receive the healing as well so what I wanted to, like one of my passions is numerology and what I wanted you to see here is that um, every number represents a different vibration than for example one represents individuality and you know uh, how much you are independent in your life for example number two represents duality and you know you uh, in relationships and then number three is the number of you know how much are you enjoy happiness um, how much you are enjoying uh, this life and on the other side um, also um, are you like radiating your li uh, light are you allowing yourself to be who you are or are you limiting yourself and uh, of course, there is so much more, but just giving you a little examples. So then we have number four, which represents um, the foundation. Uh, for example, if you uh, imagine a house, you, you need like at least four pillars so you can make it. So uh, do you have solid foundation in your um, life? So if we combine all these vibrations with number 11, it's, uh, it means 
that uh, we are going to be illuminating everything with those aspects in our life um, and everything of course because we have we are in the year of 2020 everything that um, is not in alignment alignment with ourselves so then we have number five which represents the transformation and also the balance between masculine, feminine, home, uh, etc. And it's actually like your unfoldment. How are you unfolding in um, your life? Are you showing your beauty or no, not? Then we have number six, which is connected with love and uh, relationship that you have with yourself. And of course, also your career, business, are you successful or you're not, do you feel worthy or not, and all of that things. So then we have number seven, uh, and uh, seven is a mystic number. It's connected with your gifts, uh, with learning and uh, teaching. And of course, we are all um, learning and teaching uh, each other in our lives. Then we have vibration of number eight, which represents balance and of course also manifestation, abundance, you know, infinity. So um, number nine is uh, frequency nine is frequency of uh, uh, different cycles and also ending a cycle. And it is believed to be a um, sacred number and actually um, this, we are nine months in the belly of our mothers and so it's like really a rebirth number um, really like different cycles different seasons represented them and the spiral and how we can go upward the spiral and downward the spiral and how we can experience one of the same thing through many different layers see it through many different layers so yeah, it's just the beauty of all these cycles, aspects, um, dimensions, all of that. So uh, then we have the number 10. And of course, it's number one, which represents individu individuality, like I said, and you, um, yourself, like your own authentic being. And um, number zero, representing the God self, connection with source, with your higher self, with your soul. So um, it is actually a perfect balance between uh, ego and uh, your uh, soul and also if we say a, a, a balance between human self and also uh, your spiritual um, self. So um, yeah, it's number 10 also represent, represents like are you in your power? Are you, you know, like... Do you have this balance in your life? And if you don't have it, why, don't have it, why is it that way? So yeah, it's like, if you just see the numbers, it's like really powerful and it's really time of illumination. And then we of course have 11, 11, uh, which is, let me just tell you, if we have like 11 and 111 and 1000 and 111, uh, this is a powerful day and it just means that it's a really powerful day for planting seeds and things are manifesting quicker uh, on these days and on the 1st of uh, November and 11th of uh, November and we have to be aware that we are always co-creating things in our life and uh, if we are having negative thoughts, we, things are gonna manifest quicker. So be just aware of that. And of course, if we are uh, thinking positively and just know that you are also co-creating positive and beautiful things with that. So here you can see that we are going through all these aspects. So we are going through all these different number and different aspects and I got a message that the first cycle, the first round, is going to be about um, emotional uh, stuff and clearing everything about our emotions. And then let me also tell you that today with the full moon in Taurus and of course Halloween, 31st of um, October, 
and between 31st of October and 30, 3rd of um, November, you can see that here are actually the same number. So you can see 3, 1 and 0 and 2. So you can see that are the same number. So I also got a message that in this um, cycle, on one hand, we are really gonna heal um, our wounds, our deep wounds, and also we are gonna let, be letting go um, our fears. So it's really supported to look in those aspects and to just uh, break free from whatever is still there uh, for us to learn and look into. Um, so because of that, uh, I'm organizing today a, f a full mo um, a meditation uh, for healing uh, the wounds and letting go of fears. And on 3rd uh, of November, I'm organizing the um, meditation uh, for um, really stepping in your purpose, uh, your, your mission, like really living uh, your life, um, allowing your in authentic way, allowing your soul to step forward and really share, share your gifts, letting go all the fears that you maybe have with that uh, and beliefs why you cannot be yourself. So. Uh, you can see, like I said, uh, three is the number of happiness and sun and radiating your light. So it's really powerful cycle portal between those um, those days from uh, exactly from today and until third of um, November. So for everyone that wants to join the boat meditation, I'm also offering uh, a, a, a bundle of these meditations and also you get for free that you can see what is this program, the illumination program that I'm um, preparing uh, about. So you're going to be part of it as well. And uh, if you decide, of course, and you're going to get everyday um, channeled messages, etc, etc. So I don't want uh, to talk so much about the illumination program in this video, but I would like to tell you more about numbers and everything, the vibrations and everything that I was sharing. So as I said, uh, the first round <laughs> is going to be about uh, clearing the emotions, the emotions that are still stored uh, in our body, everything connected with those aspects. Okay. Um, so, for example, if you if we are talking about uh, individuality, are you independent? Or are you really relying on other people, their opinion, etc., etc.? So it's with every aspect, really like letting go of old uh, fears and also old um, emotions, and that are still uh, and memories that are with those aspects that are um, just related to those vibrations that I was explaining before. So then we have number one, so we have like 11 and 12 and 13, 14, 15, uh, 15 <laughs> 16, 17, 18 and 19 of November. And this next cycle, it's going to be more about your mental body. So also about the beliefs that you have created from those uh, experiences connected with each aspect so it's going to be really supported to clear everything all the illusions as well all the um all the blockages and uh, just these beliefs that are not serving you on a mental body and of course on 15th we of november we have also a new moon and then like i said connected with every aspect and really going um going deeper into those aspects so then we have 20 of november and you can see it's like repeat 20 is repeating three times so it's really um, representing this balance and why and extremes and why you are not alignment in alignment with yourself so you are gonna have the chance to see if you want to see of course 
where and why you are not in alignment with yourself and because and then you have, of course we have another <laughs> another round like i said and this round and all the aspect aspects and we like we said like from one to nine so we will have 21st 22nd of november 23rd 24th all of that um, and this round is going to be more about relationships and all these, um, everything with those aspects connected with relationships. And of course, uh, that means relationship with yourself and also um, relationship with other people. And all the emotions, beliefs that you have with that, and of course, uh, healing and clearing and also all the beliefs that you have illusions that you have with that and of course the clearing and healing of all that and then um, of course I wanted to show also here how special this is that we have just uh, number two one and zeros and how it's really this this day could be 21st of uh, November can be uh, a little bit extreme <laughs> mm, because it's gonna be really about um, in one way relationships and how you are are you being yourself in relationships are you lose yourself in relationships like all of those aspects and why and when you lose yourself there so then you have 22nd of november and you can see that it's just like twos and um, again and zeros and one and of course 11 like i said is a number of illum illumination so it's really illuminating everything with this um, with these extremes in your life so just be aware of distractions different distractions in this month uh, different addictions like how you want to go to the old ways maybe how you are trying to hold on to the old ways because you are afraid of the new and sometimes it's easier and more comfortable to be in this comfort zone uh, with everything that you already know and I really really suggest you you have so um, much potential in this month you can really let go of so many things you can really uh, look into those aspects it's really supported and like I explained in the illum illumination process video um, everything that I'm gonna be doing in this program and it's of course like this program I'm offering to, for you to support you in this journey because it's gonna be intense if you are aware of it or not or you're gonna go through all these different aspects uh, on conscious or on subconscious level so yeah and that's why I'm offering this but yeah this is a perfect month of planting seeds um, seeds of what you want to do and uh, what you want to attract in your li life and really let go of any vibration that is inside you that is not serving you anymore so at the end of the month on 30th uh, uh, of november we again have a full moon so it's the whole <laughs> clearing uh, and you know uh, like really really powerful month that we are entering um, tomorrow so yeah just do your own rituals or of course you are more more than welcome to join me I'm gonna put more about this um, program in the in the comments so yeah you can watch the video that i prepared about that but let me a little bit tell you a little bit more about 30th of um, november and we have number three which i told you it's about are you radiating your um, light are you being your own authentic self um, are you sharing your gifts? Are you just being in alignment with yourself? So in one way, this day is going to allow you, if you are going to really work on those different 
aspects it's gonna allow you see how far you have come and of course it's like we have this trinity and how we have and with trinity let me um let me just share like you have how we have like the, our first experience with that is our parents and us so it's mother father and a child so how were dynamic and dynamic in those um in in those relationships so were we all equal uh, were uh, all the needs that we had in those relationships in our family equally important like this is what is shaping also um, our happiness okay so if everyone is equally important so everyone's happiness is also equally important and i'm going to share more about each vibration and all the aspects that it's good to look into of course in the program but i just want to you to i just i i want to give you a higher perspective and vision of everything share my and the vision with everything that I, that I had with everything and with this special month that we are entering and how special November December and, and December and January are gonna be so yeah I'm really really excited about that so you have still um, uh, the chance to join me and support yourself in this uh, journey and I'm really excited uh, to just plant some seeds of light uh, together with you guys uh, because we are co-creating everything together we are one and we are uh, connected so if you join me or if you do it by yourself um, just plant some seeds of light and watch them grow throughout the whole year uh, and just know that all the star seeds and all the old souls are really supported right now to look into that because next year is the time for you all um, for all the light workers to step forward and serve uh, it's gonna be a special year uh, next year and yeah and I'm going to tell you more about the upcoming year in one of the upcoming vid videos, but it's going to be a special year. And uh, for sure, believe me, for everyone that you are working on yourself, that you are looking in all those different aspects, um, people are going to need support and share sharing our experiences, how we went through all that. And yeah just uh, allow yourself to um, plant these seeds and uh, build this solid foundation for yourself so you will be able to be yourself your own authentic self and share your gifts so like i was also uh, mentioned in uh, the beginning i'm offering you uh, this meditation bundle uh, of uh, two meditations first one we are doing today uh, and it's on this special day of Halloween and full moon in Taurus and uh, like I said uh, it's about healing your uh, wounds and letting go of old fears and it's connected also with the past lifetimes whatever is influencing in you in this moment here and, and now and not allowing you to be yourself to express yourself to live your life freely okay so uh, then we have uh, on uh, 30 uh, on 3rd of uh, November we have another meditation and uh, this one is gonna be about um, pursuing your purpose your mission uh, and really stepping into that connecting with what that is uh, and of course for everyone that you're gonna take this bundle I also um, I'm also offering you from the 31st and uh, 3rd of uh, November that uh, you also get all the everything that we are going to be doing in the illumination uh, uh, program uh, okay 
so this is it what I wanted to share for today uh, I really appreciate everyone that you've joined me uh, I'm gonna be happy if you give me any feedback if this resonates with you and of course also throughout the month I wanted to give you this information so you will get more the feeling what is going on so you will understand yourself better like why all those emotions are coming out and just know that you know like this uh, illuminating light is gonna shine on all the cracks that are there there all the wounds that are there and this is where the light is gonna enter so don't fight the pain pain and um, all this, these feelings uh, and just uh, rather allow yourself to receive and what I would really suggest you as well is to join my group the Asha Marine group because there I'm doing Facebook live every um, Thursday and actually the last Facebook live was about wounds and um, fears but specifically this one was about how we are programmed our society uh, everything about emotions everything about feeling being in pain and um, you know show, showing our vulnerability and one of really important for me and interesting messages from my guides about duality and why duality starts uh, inside of us why we are seeing uh, starting to see things in our life as good or, or bad right and wrong and yeah just like separating everything and putting it in different um, boxes so anyway like i said this is what i wanted to share i appreciate all your likes and uh, all the love that you are sending me through hearts uh, let me know uh, if you are agreeing with something uh, with a thumbs up and of course uh, don't hesitate to put in your comments if you have any questions and yeah I'm excited for everyone to join me on this journey of illumination process program, program but uh, yeah, reprogram because our purpose is to step out of this um, program uh, that we have on collective level and really connect with the source, connect with ourselves and our uh, real roots, our soul roots, uh, star roots because we are all star seeds. So yeah, this is it. Uh, have a beautiful day and talk to you again soon.